Good. Hi there! <laughs> Welcome to my video blog. I'm Sonia Wick. Today I have Katie Ingram with me. Hi. Um, we've been training all day, but then we spent the afternoon in the kitchen cooking. So we're going to do a video blog today on all the cool stuff that we made. I think that today is day 29 of video blogging. I think. I think. Maybe. We think. But we're not quite sure. So I think it's day 29. Getting really close to 30, which means I'm like three away from one third of the way done. And it's February. And it's February. Mm -hmm. Woohoo! Okay, so we got busy in the kitchen today. We started off by making, from the Osmo website, you can download this handy dandy little paper that has a whole bunch of recipes on it for real food options for while riding your bike. There's bars, Power Bites, chocolate almond power cookies, rice paper wrapper packets, lots of good stuff. But we went for the protein power bite today. Oh, oh. We'll show you that in a second. Okay, so the power bites we made. I can show one. So what did we do? We took like a ton of almond butter and protein powder. Flax seed. Flax seed. Coconut. Coconut, yep. And put it in the in the the mix the that thing, yeah. food processor. Mix it up, made it. balls. Ooh. Yeah, and then we like wrapped them in chocolate. Yeah. So cocoa powder. Cocoa powder, raw yeah. cocoa powder. Protein power bites from the Osmo website. Yeah. We're pretty excited about those. And then put them in the fridge to get cold, which they were in oh, process. The, I think there was salt in them. Oh, the salt. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yep. Sea salt. Yep. Did that. Okay. The other thing we made was. Phil's fudge. And this came, this was like inspired by Phil Mactone. This we're not sure about. We're not so sure about <laughs> it. Um, we used the recipe that had been altered. Oh, oh it like started moving. Yeah. <laughs> that had been Be altered careful. by um, Paul and Angela Duncan. Mm -hmm. um, Nate Duncan, you know. And the recipe for this is on the Outstrip Endurance website. Mm -hmm. um, his like tweaks. And yeah, it's fudge. And so okay, this is like honey, honey, a cup of honey, cup of coconut oil, cup of coconut oil heated, like melted, mm -hmm. uh, cocoa powder, cup of raw cocoa powder, and a cup of protein powder, which we and a cup of protein powder, which we've been using. <laughs> yeah, I was getting rid of that one, yeah. so we used a whole bunch of that. But we used a lot more of this than a cup. A lot of that because mm -hmm. we it seemed too liquidy, and we had to keep adding things yeah. to try to like. Consolidate it. We're not sure on this one, but Angela swears by it and says it's like her favorite thing to have in the evening when she um, still needs a snack. Mm -hmm. She's a little snacky. It has like a lot of fat in it and cocoa and protein. Protein. Mm -hmm. So pretty good. good for the belly. Good for the belly. Then the third recipe we made was called Nix bars. Yes. <laughs> and we pretty much like demolished that recipe. Like yeah, we we're not even close on that. We one. didn't even <laughs> really listen to it. It had like dates. We didn't have dates. No. What else did it have that we didn't? Um, there were like three or four things. things. Yeah. Oh, cereal. We didn't cereal, have cereal. We didn't have cereal. Yeah. So we took pretzels and like munched them up. Yeah. Because we um, had pretzels. I think we put in like maybe twice as much almond butter. We put in more <laughs> almond butter. You heat almond butter and honey on the stove, mm -hmm. and then you add it to like dry ingredients, yeah. oats and stuff. So that is in the oven. So we'll take it out. I feel like we're so Martha Stewart right now. We're like mm -hmm. taking things out of the oven. Oh yeah. Okay. I think they're done. Okay. So they came out like this, and they, so they, they look exactly oh, the same. Oh, we added seeds. We oh, yeah, added we put pumpkin seeds and sunflower seeds. and sunflower seeds. Yeah. So it kind of almost it popped up a little bit actually. And flax seeds. Flax. Yeah, there's flax in there. Yeah. And then you'll. I think you're supposed to let this thing cool a little bit and, and then, then cut it, it up. into bars. Yeah. Yeah. Into bars. So we'll let it do that. I think. So it's that's basically nothing like the Nick bar recipe. No, I don't think <laughs> what we did. We're gonna go ahead and call that the Sonia and Katie bar yeah. recipe because it's a lot more like that. Um, what's in your kitchen bar? What's in your mm -hmm. kitchen? Yeah. Get rid of good. stuff in your kitchen. Um. So yeah, we just put this in there. We did. Ron, punk rock runner Ron gave me some of this, so we tried some of that. It was kind of hard. Yeah. Um. We used a lot of almond butter today. A lot of coconut oil. Mm -hmm. A lot of coconut. Yeah. A lot of cocoa, cocoa powder. powder. Um, protein and powder. Protein powder gone. and flax. Yeah. So that went in something. Oh, it's some instant non-fat dry milk had yeah. to go into something. Something. I forget. That's okay. But we had fun. We probably spent, I don't know, maybe an hour. Yeah. Yeah, that's about it. And now we have all these good, like, tasty treats, we think, mm -hmm. that will be good for later. Um, yes. I don't know. You have any prophetic things to say about our cooking? No. <laughs> 
I made Katie mm-hmm. ride her bike and swim pretty hard today. Mm-hmm. She's tired. Yeah. Um, not as tired as last time. Not as tired as last time. Yeah. More packing in there. Yep. We're yeah. having fun. I have a quote of the day today. I didn't have one um, yesterday because, well, I thought Angela was just big, one big fat quote of the day. So here we go. John Gordon. This was sent to me from Gretchen. My phone is just making like horrible noises. Gretchen is one of my athletes. She lives in Texas. And she said that everyone at work was sent this quote, um, and she wanted to pass it on to me. We don't get burned out because of what we do. We get burned out because we forget why we do it. Purpose keeps you fresh. Mm, I like that. You like that? I do. Do you think it's true? Totally. Yeah? yeah? What do you think purpose even means? Purpose keeps you fresh. I think, when I think of purpose, I think of, like, maybe my goals, mm-hmm. my long-term goals, like yeah. having to re re-remember and and think about how much my long-term goals mean to me when, when I'm I think feeling about burned out burned out I feel like that's when you're bogged down bogged down yeah, yeah. you forget why. right you're just like oh I have to do this I don't know why yeah or you're yeah. being pulled in like a lot of directions mm-hmm. I know I feel burned out when I yeah have like a lot of extraneous stuff going on and then I like get down to my workout and I'm like oh I, just, I don't want to do it yeah. I forget about you know having like a more focused purpose yeah I like that yeah, yeah. that's a good one all right, that's all we've got today. Have a great day. Um, I hope it's a wonderful one. It is really windy and cold here, but I hope you're having sunny weather. Wherever you are. With no wind. Yes. And it's warm. And We're you going can... to sunny weather soon. Yes, <laughs> soon. Anyway, over and out. See you later. Bye.